channel my name is sean and this is the fallen army south african gaming channel and we are back with some more tokyo dark and let us see where the forest is gonna take us and find this cult camp is our next segment into this playthrough so let us continue this amazing journey together well if the continue button will click in hello okay there it's good it's working it's working i uh, maybe maybe it's working i hope it's working yeah, that's pretty loud. Game's got some pretty loud side effects most of the time. Woo. Okay, well, finally, this must be the path to the old woman was talking about. If her story was true, all I need to do is follow it to the Kamikai old compound. Let's hope it's that simple. No time to sit here and think it through. I need to get through these woods before nightfall. Yeah, so here we are. Let's just make our way slowly through this scary as dark forest. I have no clue what is going to pop out at us here. Take it nice and slowly. Maybe move a little bit faster, I guess. There we go. Keep going. Oh, okay. Sounding very ominous now. Why does it look like we've been turned around? Like the same. It looks the same. See that? Three statues covered in moss and undergrowth. It looks like one is missing. A depiction of a Jizo summer. Whoa, why is it so loud? Holy, my ears are gonna burn. Damn. They look old and forgotten. It's kind of sad to them being abandoned like this. How could these statues help anyone out in such a dark place? Wowza. That was pretty loud. Okay, so we need to find... Probably we need to find the, the, the third one on there, right? Oh, what the... What is that? Did you see that? It looks like we're back in the bloody tunnel again. What is going on here? Hello. This forest is playing tricks on our heads now. This has got to be a dream. Rena! What is she doing here? Huh? Where am I? No. Anyway, but here? I don't want to remember this. Why now? Aito! Why did you come here? You left me here to die again, haven't you? It was your fault that this happened to me. You're so selfish. You never cared about what happened to anyone but yourself. People who get hurt along the way are just a collateral damage. It's all about you and what you want. You, 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 you! You're not, allowed, you're not looking for me. You only want to hurt the girl. To hurt the old woman. To see everyone who gets her in your way to suffer. No, that is not true. I have done anything to change what happened to you. Make, make it go away. I can't bear it anymore. Stop. Make it stop. I don't want to remember. <laughs> what a great idea. Remembering hurts, doesn't it? Let me take all the pa that pain. Let's forget together. Oh wow, what's going on here? Yeah. Uh, 
And if you don't press anything, oh, this is getting crazy. Uh oh. I wonder if the screen gets full of that, will something happen? Or do you have to actually click on something? Uh oh. I actually don't know, I'm, still, I'm kind of like, I'll, I'll, I'd like to press something, but... Uh oh, hope that hasn't done anything to alter my character now. Oh, there's somebody hanging now out there in the distance. That's not creepy at all. Okay, now there's two dead bodies hanging. Oh, oh, hello. We got we got ourselves the the other statue. I feel a familiar presence as I pick it up. Oh no! I wonder if I need to go back. Is this all a dream? <gasps> the hell is going on? Uh, night terrors are not fun at all. What the hell is going on here now? Jeez! The way you were sleeping, I thought you'd never wake up. Huh? Where? Thank goodness you're okay. I knew I'd find you. Huh? Find me? What are you talking about? I haven't gone anywhere. I saw you on the ground. Reina, she, she slit your throat. That must have been a hell of a nightmare you had. Nothing but a good cup of coffee can fix. Speaking of, I fixed the coffee machine, so you officially file that case as closed. Hey, you okay? You look a little out of it. Take your time getting ready. I'll be in the next room. Yeah, thanks. What is this? I was looking for something, wasn't I? Why can't I remember? My heart's beating a mile a minute. I can't shake the feeling of the dread that's hanging in the air. Is this real, right? I want it to be real. And if it is real, it would be nice. Well, we don't have the pulse anymore. Well, come back to the real world, sleepyhead. Huh? You're not dressed? You didn't forget about our picnic, did you? Picnic? We're gonna have a picnic in the park and see the cherry blossoms, remember? I know it's not exactly traditional, but I figured we could grab a pizza on the way over there, too. Mmm, pizza, yum yum. I'd like one right now. Ah, uh, it's important time of, of the year after all. Did you forget that, too? Don't you remember when the cherry blossoms fell, you saved those two girls at the shrine? You're a hero! Uh, hello? I saved her then? What? Okay. Saved? No. I'm no hero. She died. I killed her. She's alive? Always trying to stop us from stop me from something doesn't feel right. This isn't where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> of course it is. We're together. The sun's out and we got Lady Fluff. <laughs> okay, sanity is minus five again. Shut. Isn't this what you wanted? With your partner gone, appearance gone, Lady Fluff and I are the only family you've got left. This is where you belong, and we loved you. That's why we, we came with us. Come on, we gotta get going. Go. Where are you taking me? Somewhere safe. Safe? Why? Where, where was I going? Where's the path? 
The path isn't for you, it leads to suffering. So let's leave the path and be happy forever. Okay, I can't play with the cat. And I can't do anything else except for go to the picnic. What the hell is going on? Okay. Okay. What the hell is going on here? But anyway. Isn't this nice? We're all here like one big happy family. We don't need anyone else. 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 What the hell? We don't need anyone else. We don't need anyone else. It's better this way. Stay here. Stay here. Stay here. It's safe. Stay here and rot. What? What the matter with you? Nothing is the matter. We're exactly where we need to be. This is all so wonderful. I've taken you somewhere safe. Just like I promised. Far away from places you didn't belong. You're safe here. You can't hurt anyone anymore. Free from those pesky painful memories. So let's forget. Together. Lie down where it's comfortable and stay there. Forever and ever and ever. No! Ignoring the pain won't, give, won't make it go away. Wouldn't want me to forget. He'll tell me to keep on going. I know this place... <coughs> so, excuse me. I've been here before. It's strange in the same suffering as before. Reina, why did you take me here? Why won't you leave me alone? Why do you want to hurt me so badly? Why did you come here? Don't make me remember. Whoa, what's going on here? Oh, no. What the? Whoa. Wow, this is madness. Total insanity, that's what's going on. I never felt Rainer's presence so strongly before. If I didn't come to my senses, I might have. Why now? What is in this forest that she doesn't want me to find? A lot of death, though. You can smell it in the air. We just gotta get the statues placed, I guess. The air completely changed when I placed the statue with the others. The forest doesn't seem so dark. I can see a clearing up ahead. Is it over? Reina, are you still somewhere? What's all that laughing going on? Holy cow. Okay. Looking at it now, I can't help but feel underwhelmed. For all the scenery classification classified secrecy classified documents and foreboding stories all i see is drab gray structures in the forest clearing but it's eerie over a decade ago 12 people died here and this compound was left standing as a grim reminder it gives me the creeps i should find out what i came here for and get back before sundown what was Raina trying so hard to prevent me from finding here oh we'll find out now i guess Okay, there's some buildings, some stairs. Well, here we go. The truth shall set us free, hopefully. Or it will not set us free. Oh, hello. Mommy! Reina! Where are you? I miss you. Shh! Keep your voice down, sweetheart. I can't stay long. Why not? Why don't you stay with me anymore? Well, that's that's complicated. The guru thinks it's best if we all we're apart from a while. He has a big plan for us, and for you especially. Who cares about all that, honey? It's not that simple. Why not? Why won't they let us be together? Because you're so pure and perfect. I know you love me, but I'm no good if I stay with you. Uh, he says I'll corrupt you, but I'm so weak. I wanted to see you. It's our little secret, okay? Okay, mommy. Is it my fault you can't stay with us anymore? Oh, Raina, no. Of course not. It's me. You're going to be a big, important person someday. I can't hold you back. I know that doesn't make uh, a whole lot of sense right now, but someday you'll understand. Tokamasa has big plans for you. He told me himself. 
He said you're the key to everything because you're so pure. Remember why we left the city? Because everyone was so mean and out for themselves? They're all stained by corruption, but not us. Not not you, anyways. I I thought you said we were going home. We can't. Tokamasa says that the great machine's done for, and that all those corrupt people will kill each other out in the walls and die, and we'll be left. But you'll be there to guide them soon. You've been chosen by Tokimasa. D die? I don't want anyone to die. Yes, me neither, sweetie. But, but like I said, Tokamasa has figured out a new ritual, and you will be able to help everyone. I don't understand. Why are you saying all these weird things? Nah, Reina. It's not easy for me either, but it's not about what we want all the time. If you do this, it'll help me. You want to help mommy, don't you? <laughs> yeah, I guess. Exactly. So let's smile, okay? Hey, guess what? What? Before the ritual, there's going to be a big celebration just for you. It's a big feast. What's that mean? It's a big meal where everyone gets to eat all the food they want. It's like a party. Doesn't that sound fun? I guess so. Then I'll come back to see you again. Do you promise? Yeah, afterwards we'll all go out together to do to the ritual. All together? I thought you said it was just me. Like I said, sweetheart, you've been chosen. Tokimasa says you'll gain the sight to guide us to salvation. Okay. Hey, don't look so sad. You'll get, you'll get me crying if you do. And don't want to see mommy cry, do you? No. Good, Reina. I, I need you to listen to me now. Here, I want you to have this. It's mommy's amulet. The one I kept since I was little. I want you to have it for the ritual. When it, when it starts, I want you to hold it and keep your eyes shut tight, okay? If you get scared... Just grab it tight and think of me, okay? But that amulet is yours. Don't you need it? But if something bad happens to you? It's more important you have it now. Promise me you'll do what I ask. I uh, I promise. Let's make a pinky promise. Okay. And you know what happens when you break a pinky promise, right? Yeah, you said that pinkies would fall off. Exactly. And we wouldn't want that, would we? After tomorrow, things will be different. Maybe even a little scary, but it will be not all bad. The most important thing is that Tokomasa told us that we'll be together. I love you, Reina. I love you too, Mommy. Wow. Wow, that's just deep. That is... Deep. Oh, hello. Oh, Reina. Maybe you shouldn't be here. Huh? Why not? The feast isn't for you. It's for us, the impure who must prepare themselves. Tokamasa says that the unpure must purify themselves by feasting and expunging the darkness from their bodies. If I can remember un remain uncorrupted, even someone worthless like me will be able to ascend to a higher plane. I I don't think you're worth this. Everyone keeps telling me I'm so special. But no one visits me anymore. And where's everyone else? They're hiding from me too now? The others are with the guru preparing themselves for tomorrow. Don't worry, Rena. Every, everything will be clear tomorrow. There's nothing to fear. Hey! Can I have a little of that? The great Tokomasa instructed us not to give you any food at the feast. Oh. Don't you see? You are pure. The feast is for the indulgent. Is there to test us. To show us that we are corrupted with stains of impurity upon us. It is a reminder of how great the machine of man keeps our souls shackled and chained. Those who are cleansed must not turn away from the righteous path. Right? But you're very lucky, yes, so lucky to be in Tokomasa's favor. He chose you. He chose you to be the bearer of the mask, to see the great door to the pure realm. Those are the children who were taken 
that too was a test to key to find the most pure among you you understand don't you um i don't know oh yes of course not you are but a child Tukamasa says that you children are much wiser than us that your understanding of the world is untainted where's mommy mommy ah yes i imagine she is with the guru she is in need of the guru's love yeah we all know what that means huh? yes her mind has gone astray of late in such a key moment the guru will show her the way don't worry mother father sister brother it doesn't matter we are all family you should go back to your bed i don't know why the guru let someone so important wander freely what if something happened to you like it did the others what others do not fear child the great tokomasa's prophecy will come to pass and there will be no fear very soon you should go to sleep child and remember do not eat this meal it is food for us the pitiful huh what's wrong why are you looking at me like that nothing it's nothing the ritual is soon it will be the time of the great change go away why tomorrow you will guide us but look at you so young hmm we must be resilient fear is pure emotion all forms of life feel fear to fear is not weakness but a test you are testing me the guru is wise are you okay you looking at me funny again it's nothing what do you want um do you know where takashi is weak you're weak don't think of them don't cloud your thoughts you must remain as you are needn't worry tokamasa will guide us just wait what's wrong oh imako would be their mother ah oh reina what are you doing here you scared me i i'm sorry it's all right you didn't mean it did you no then there's nothing to worry about do do you want something why isn't takashi or the baby here with you they he and his sister were not meant for the path of purity not like you it's the night before the ritual i must unburden myself with thoughts of them what's the unburden mean unburden reina it it it's it means to have forgotten them yes forgot forget the children imiko becoming too attached to the offspring is part of mankind's great machine it is a lie this was a test they did not pass you must we are so close to our goal yes of course I will not check on myself to meaningless connections. Reina, don't worry. Tomorrow's a great ritual. Takamasa has envisioned. And you're the guest of honor. Especially everything will be alright. Really? Yes, of course. Now run along. Damn. It's like the sacrificial lamb getting fattened up for the for the slaughter. I, I can't. I can't let my daughter be in this ritual. That's not for you to decide. You know her importance. What the guru says she can show us. But but she's my daughter. Takamasa hasn't told us what we, he is going to do to her. She is our daughter. What if it doesn't work like he says? She, she's so young. You doubt him now? It's because she's so young she was chosen. Her mind is not stained, stained by regret, sadness or corruption. She is perfect. I, I know, just... Then why hesitate? The guru tells us you were approach, approaching the moment that will bring us true peace. The accumulation of everything would have worked for. Somehow your child is a focal point. He says she'll grant a sight even more profound than his own. She can lead us. I only want to make sure she's okay. He promised me she'll be safe, but I'm not sure sure. The guru will make sure she's taken care of. She won't she'll want for nothing to be blessed with a new sight. It's the only way. The world is on the brink of ruin and there's no time left. My own children will will Himiko, don't worry. You'll be safe. 
No, my own mother betrayed me. She dragged my children away to die in the filth. I, I'm sorry. I must be strong. Soon we'll have no more worries than a sin from our flesh. You know, don't you? I saw you outside when he told us. Yes. Of all the things I studied, they were only ever used to corrupt people, to control one another, to hurt one another. Soon, we'll be free of that and we'll escape the suffering of this world and be reborn. <clears throat> and, it, it, and it will be Reno who will show us the way. She will be the bridge. You're right. I always knew she was special. Even when she was growing inside me, I could feel it. Promise me again. Promise me she'll be taken care of. Okay, so it looks like there's nothing else left here now. Wow, we got a, a lot of insight now. <clears throat> what, what truly ex it happened here? Oh, oh, oh. What's this? It looks like a simple wooden amulet. How did I not notice it before? It's probably the same one, maybe. What is this? I feel strange, like I'm back there again. Oh, hello! Oh, that's scary. Okay, so that's her wearing the mask. Whoa, 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 Where am I? The forest? I, I, I saw things in a strange running. When, when I found the amulet, it cut away the fog that had been surrounding me and showed me the truth. The mask, the Kamekai, Reina, was there the whole time. They all killed themselves and made her wear the mask. That day was when shit started, when Reina became the mask bearer, when her suffering truly began. The pulse of the dark has changed again, and the fuzzy image had before has snapped into focus. Everything I need to put an end to this is in my hands. How long has it been, I wonder? A man in a sewer, a girl with red hair, memories and thoughts that aren't my own. I'm in a over my head. I'm, I'm so stretched out it feels like the slightest breeze could topple me. And each time I get close to the truth, something drags me further away. I feel like I've, I'm so close. All the threads are leading to one place, and yet I haven't stopped to think of what finding it means. I'm on a ride that I have no control over, and then moving too fast to focus on what is passing me by. If only I could go back and slow down, give myself some time to think. Instead, I keep rushing forward, towards the unknown. Before I went, I thought I had a handle on all the things. Then Rainer showed up and turned it all on its head. My whole life I thought if I only connected the dots and contextualized the clues, it would make everything simpler and all work out. This time I'm not so sure. The only thing left to do is hold on tight and see where I end up. With me, with me is the little wooden mask that so many died for, and now I'm using it to using it myself. It doesn't feel right. It was her pain I felt back in the compound, the focal point to all her misery. I wonder if it's the real rain I've seen, or is it that girl long ago? No. What I felt in the compound and that misery I feel in the dark are the same. It's her. 
the mask, Reina, the dark, all tied to the door. Despite everything I've seen and all the mysteries that has been explained to me, what awaited me there was still unknown. My only chance to see it again is to go into those filthy tunnels and find it. Only then do I have the hope of using it to change his fate. Something with that much power would have cost, and I'm forced to accept it without question. Nothing can be ever be s the same after today. My chance is a normal life disappearing the minute I took the mouse from evidence. Or maybe it would be have found its way back to me eventually. The man I've suffered so much for has been silent. Maybe he's not down there anymore. I've seen what Rain has become as a result of the mask. Would that happen to me now that I know the way? Is that what I really want? The horrible object was made out of death and innocent people and fed hundreds of years later with more death. Why continue the cycle? That's a good question. Why should I destroy it? I suppose that's obvious. Because I'll be destroying and Reina along with it. If I don't act soon, it feels like the world will tear itself apart at the seams. The dark is creeping in at the seams, affecting people even if they can't see like I, can, I, like I do. I have to do something. Are the two places where my path started also where it has to end? This is it. I need to choose. Follow the thread further into the darkness or attempt to cut it and return to the light. Ah, la 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 la. So now... But, but, but I don't know actually I'm trying to debate this now because the problem is I'm a little scared So we can go back where it started to destroy Reina or we can go to the other place. Oh my gosh.
Oh my goodness, I have no clue. Well, any mini money mo, hey? How does that feel? Okay, I don't know. Do we go back here? Or do we go back there? Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's take the one path. Hopefully it's the right one. Uh oh. It feels strange to be back on these streets, knowing everything I do now. Ancient cults, a troubled family, a girl named Reyna, all the united by the history of death and suffering caused by a simple object. All that meaningless death of innocent people of for what? To protect mankind? To make us better? Don't make me laugh. No more. I've gone down this rabbit hole far enough. I refuse to be a slave to the mask any longer. Oh good lord. I'll destroy it. Turn it back to ashes and do the world a favor. My final defiant act as reality breaks apart at the seams. Are waiting for me at the shrine. They know it all well. I do the torment of the mask brings with it. Let's hope the old woman can do what she says she can. Okay, so we are... Looks like we're heading in to actually get the mask destroyed. Oh, shit! Why are you being so creepy right now, mask? Look at the mask. It's... No! I don't like this! Why now? Is it trying to stop me? This mask, born out of death and suffering, shouldn't be in this world. Maybe those people were trying to restore things. Uh, why am I thinking about that? I have to keep moving. What is this feeling? Fear? It, I, I'm afraid to go forward. I have to go back. I can't move. Death. Everything about this place feels like death. What if I'm wrong? Kazuki, Reina, they could still be down there. That's what it wants. It, it's why I need to destroy it. But, oh God, what will happen? Why is it pleading with me? All those lives trapped in the mask want to be free, don't they? Then why? I could still turn back now. It's my last chance. I, I'm so confused. What do I do? Oh my goodness, I don't know. You see... There's no way to... Do you see it's an auto save, so you can't go and uh, make a mini save. I don't know, guys. They'll go with the choice to destroy the mask. And then we're going to play the game through again to see what other choices we have. Hey. Okay. Oh, right. Let's do it. They could still be alive, but I don't know. I don't even know what actually is going on. Is this a dream? Is this reality? Is the mask really real? There's so many things happening here. Maybe destroying the mask kills everybody. I don't know. Ito, so you came after all. Yes, of course she did. She knew it was the right thing to do. You brought something, didn't you, from the compound? I did. I found an old wooden amulet. You were right. The darkness I felt there was the same. Seriously? Wait. This, this is actually real? When I was there, I saw visions from the past of people who are gone now. I know uh, the ritual Takamasa tricked them into performing. How could you have let it happen? She was just a little girl. There's no answer I can give that would satisfy you. No answer? Is that the best you can do? That's why you fled, isn't it? You knew all about Takamasa's ritual and what would happen to everyone who was left behind. Yet you took Mai and Takashi and ran and did nothing to stop it. Stop it? What would have changed? Imiko knew what she staying meant for her, children as well as I. She was willing to die however Takamasa told her to. I couldn't persuade my own daughter to save herself. You think I didn't try? The police never would have believed an old woman talking about her ancient rituals. I have no choice. They were monsters. They weren't monsters. They were lost, looking for answers in a world that had none of them. Much like you, like us. In my ears with the mask, I could hear them sometimes in the darkness along with the voices I did not recognize. 
I always thought that they were vengeful, restless, punishing me for my sins. Once we purify the mask, perhaps they will forgive us. Did you find the girl who's chasing you, this Reina? Did you ask her forgiveness? Forgiveness? I'm not sure if that is possible anymore. After everything the girls went through, all of her self-hatred and her sorrow are part of the mask now. I feel as it all as a shrine the day I shot her. Do you think that this will put a stop to it all? The whispers, Reina, all the strange things we've seen? Atonement is a journey, one that expands past time on this earth. It will at least allow us to take the first step into rightening our own sins. Our sins? Huh? Hold on, I've only ever done the good luck, what good luck, rituals and harmless little blessings. This is different. Grandma, this is real. I don't know if I can do this. Mai, calm down. Calm yourself. A ritual has meaning in its own very act. It is the God's way of pre preparing us for the true pe test. You are a pure child and combined with your will, the ritual will gain power. It will work. It must. Why me? Because you are not corrupted by it. Only you can. You can bring your mother peace. Please, Mai, you have to try. I know you think it's crazy, but this mess has caused a lot of people to suffer. It doesn't matter if you believe us. Just do do it knowing that it will help me and your grandma move on. You haven't seen what we've seen, so I don't blame you for being skeptical, but you can believe in helping right? us, right? I just want this all to end. Me too. Every day it's been harder to keep things straight, and I think this mask is partly to blame. It's silly. I'm not religious. I never have been. But I want this all to stop, to be normal again. I want to believe that it will work and in you. So please, I'm begging you to try. Okay. Thank you, Mai. Mai, are you ready? I just need a moment to prepare. What if we're wrong? What do you mean? What if the mask isn't the problem? What if it's making it worse? An old man told me that the mask didn't create the shadows. It only opens your visions to them. So are we doing the right thing? What if we're missing something? Are you losing your resolve? No, it's just... The man who died, the one I was searching for, he always said, What if it isn't good enough for a detective? I guess old habits die hard and there's still so much I don't understand. And you never will. It's a matter of faith, child. Okay, I'm ready. Imiko, please forgive me for leading you to those people and for what happened to you. I tried to save you. I tried. I prayed. You find peace. Grandma, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. As the ritual continued, I felt an overwhelming sadness. Like something had been ripped out of me that I would never find again. At the moment, the whispers of the mask turned. Desperate, pleading screams. I closed my eyes and... Hugged myself like a child, feeling at the moment utterly engulfed in fear. Oh, I hope I chose the right, yeah. <laughs> okay, the, the mask looks like it's severed, it's broken. Then there was silence. When I opened my eyes, the mask was split into two. I knew at the moment was dead and he ha had been all along. We all left the shrine in silence. I never returned. Nothing was quite right after that day. Reina's presence was gone, but I started to feel other things. The shadows... Oh, I'm getting goosebumps all over my body now. Ooh. Ooh. The shadows began to take on new fearful shapes. Tokyo began to change. Crime shot up and the murder rate peaked at an all-time high that year. Oh my goodness. So technically, this was not a good idea. The police were so swamped with the wave of violence they were, that reinstated me as a homicide detective, the investigation into me was dropped entirely. I quit within six months, just didn't have the stomach for it anymore after what happened to, and I could never focus. What if the ritual was a mistake? What if everything that happened since it is all my fault? Sometimes I wake up at night wondering if the world of dark was the truth and my life was now a dream it's, it's, it's a dream 
and of the image after being exposed to the bright flash. I don't go out much these days. I cannot bear to face the real world. Oh wow. <clears throat> uh, what ending did we get there? Mm, wow. Wow, 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 guys. Um, the goosebumps are still roaming all over my body. It's like insane. Like, just reading that. Also, what did I do? Like, was that even the right decision? Should I have gone the other way? But I'm sure we'll be able to find out on another playthrough. Hmm. Wow, man. I really wanted to see if I could save um, our, uh, our friend and to see if Reyna could actually be saved. Oh wow, there's something more? The Collector. Interesting. Most interesting. <clears throat> You're nothing but a crow feeding on the caron that time leaves in its wake. Hmm. Forgive me for not being impartial spectator of human suffering. So what are these like the gods? The woman had her own desires. I only gave her a little push. But the result, this cannot be. Not right at all. The moss rid from this world, I won't accept it. Why? What do you care? Shall I tell you the reason it bothers you so? Because you gain nothing from this truth, but makes no mistake. It is a truth, another possibility. Time is not a single thread, but a complex tapestry. Pushed and formed into a picture by force of fate and chance. The different threads present of a myriad of truths. But all an aspect of the same visage. Nothing than the less. A mirage? A mirage? Interesting, interesting. I would have thought once interested in history would I hear to a single truth. Oh, on the contrary. If history has taught me anything it is that there is not no one truth. The deeper one gazes, the more complex it becomes. Yes, all are truth, all grant insight into the same puzzle. You're right, my old friend. Time is, sp 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 what? Time is a spiral, and observed in a long enough, and we may yet learn something. No, she is not your plaything. It is not your decision. There is only one way this can end. Only one way the world to remain intact and stop the thing that's coming. It must be protected. The role must be performed. So stubborn, so stubborn. Allow me to ask you a question. I believe I know it already. You've asked it before. Indulge me. I'll ask her the same question. If the dancing puppet looks up and sees its strings, does it remain a puppet? What of fate and chance then? I answer your riddle with one of my own. You see the storm clouds approaching, and though you can take shelter or alter your course, does the storm not come regardless? Ah, no fun. You never tolerated my philosophical side. 
nor you me, when I tell you how things are. I suppose that's because we are all one and the same, but what of her? All we can do is see, but eventually she will end up here. I end up there. There is only one path which will hold the world together. Oh, hello? Okay, so that is one of the endings. Hot damn! And then we also got ourselves a new game plus. Mmm, yeah, yeah. But yeah, let us stop it on this episode because now I think this is part six. We finally finished the game itself. And we got a pretty dark ending, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not too sure which ending we got. Um, there is about 11 or so, they say, there is in this game. So we're definitely going to do another run through. So we can actually see what other choices we can take. And New Game Plus is pretty cool. I don't know, not too sure what's going to come out of it. Maybe different choices and different options. But we'll give that a go. So that has been Tokyo Dark. And it has been very enjoyable playing through this game. The art style, the gameplay, the story. Everything has been phenomenal. I really, really have enjoyed it. If you guys liked it as well, comment down below and let me know what you think of the game. And also, why not go get it yourselves and give it a try and see what decisions and choices you come out with. And let me know in the comments on what ending you got. Because I know most of us would have got different endings in general anyway. So... Let us focus on that, and yeah, I really want to see a more happy, brighter ending for Aito, because I do feel a little bit sad now that she didn't get the, the ending she really wanted, and to be honest, I think that's more my fault that I'm deciding to not do certain decisions and choices, but that is our way of making our path, so we will do that on the next playthrough. So thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you'll be notified for future uploads in the future and to help me grow the channel. And thank you so much for all the new subscribers. We're getting very, very close to that 500 mark. You guys are amazing. God bless you all. And you know what? I love you guys so much. So do hang in there. We will see you on the next video itself. Have yourselves a blessed day. Goodbye from me, Sean, and the full army. I salute you. Cheers.